Hello everyone. Today I am going to teach you how we can set up MongoDB with our Node.js project, and we will also set up our Node.js project. Okay. So now I am going to open my project. So go inside wave underscore app and then I am going to choose backend. As you know that we have already created Node.js project. And we have already installed Express and Nordmon into our project. Okay. Now I am going to add some more dependencies. Okay. So right here in the terminal npm i dot env. body parser and we will use mongoose ok so we can communicate with the database with mongodb with the help of mongoose so just press enter to install these all dependencies Okay, this will be double O. So you can see we have successfully installed our dependencies. Now just open Google Chrome. and just search mongodb into google so you will get this website www.mongodb.com ok go here You can see this type of interface you will get. Okay, so here uh, just go here and try free. Okay, here you will see sign up form. If you don't have account in MongoDB, then you can create your account from here and if you already have account then you can sign in from here so I am going to create account so I am going to continue with sign up with google ok so just press on this and this is my email id I am going to use this email id so just click on this and then check this box and submit this to accept this privacy policy in terms and conditions okay Now this type of form you will see ok so you can select anything according to your need ok
and just press on finish so you will get this type of interface inside mongodb so here you can see these are the type of database so i am going to use this free database m0 because in m10 it is taking 1.08 dollar per hour and this is 0.210 dollar so i am going to use this free database and just mention this database name cluster name okay Ovala cluster okay and now just press on create you can see our cluster is creating here you can set a username and password ok so the username will be Ola and the password will be don't use uh, at the rate in your password here okay and here we will use add my current ip address no no sorry mm. just skip this now i'm going here network access section okay and just press add ip address so you will get this type of form and just click on this allow access from anywhere so you can see the ip address will be 000 and uh, here in the database access section you can set username and password which we have already which we have recently added okay so from here you can write your username password and all I have already added so I am not going to create this and just go inside database just click on this connect and then click on this mongodb for vs code editor then you will get this link ok so just copy this and uh, open your node.js project index.js file and here we will use express first we will import express which we have already installed in our previous session ok So this is for express now i'm going to import dot env require dot env and then we need to configure this okay and here we will use mongoose and just connect our mongodb ok so here mongoose.connect inside this connect just paste this url which we have already copied so the url is this url ok so just copy this url and paste here 
and change username password and uh, database name okay so our our username is ubola which we have recently created okay and the password is ps12345 which we have already created okay and now i am going to uh, mention now i am going to create the database so the database name will be ubola okay and here i am going to handle this mongoose whether it is connected or not okay so here mongoose dot connection dot once and here we will use open and then okay when the connection will when the mongoose will be connected then this console will so otherwise this console will show okay now i am going to set up the server okay so here we will use app dot listen and we need to define port port number okay so Firstly, I am going to create env file here. In dot env and the port number will be 3000. You can use any port number, okay? And here we will use process dot env dot port dot okay port port is the key which we have mentioned inside env file, okay? So with the help of this we can achieve port number here okay and here server is running on process dot env dot so here uh, we will also show port number and here we will add route uh, on which route or what page will open or what will open okay so here we will use app dot use and then when it will be route route okay and it will take two parameter request and response okay response dot send home page Now I am going to run this server and pm start. So you can see server is running on 3000 port. This is running and then our MongoDB is connected. So we have successfully connected MongoDB also and we have run our server also. Now I am going to check this url whether it is working or not okay so the port number is 3000 as you know 
here we will write localhost 3000 then you will get this home page text which we have written here okay so this route is also working fine now i am going to create the structure so here we will use model now i am going to set up our uh, project structure okay so this will be model and uh, just skip this uh, we will see one further video okay so thank you for watching this video